Elizabeth Smart died today at 10.15, they say. And she's made out to be a hero, which I, I suppose she is. We don't know what was happening between she and John before he ran off and had another girlfriend. I think that we have to remember there are always two sides to everything. Always. And when one side cuts off The other side is left holding the burden. And I, I would say that in my case with my family, they just simply stopped all and every bit of communication to me. I think in four years, I think my dad has emailed me maybe twice about trips he was going on. And I have had two or three emails from his ex-wife, I mean his current wife. But it doesn't matter what I say it doesn't matter what I write they, they don't have to agree with it um, and yet Even just in a recent conversation with my stepmother, and she said, "Well, you know, you, you know, essentially, well, you pissed your dad off again just when things were starting up." And it just struck me as where if they feel I've done something wrong then and they they claim to be these true Christians forgiveness leads the way and it has to be for all of us because without forgiveness if we don't forgive someone we hold on and it festers and festers and festers and uh, I've, been, I've had to do that even with my own mother too and so many of you who know me know that I mean she essentially raised me and Now I don't, I don't even know for a fact if she's well, if she's not well, where she's living, you know. And it's just because there was no communication. And so I, I encourage you never to cut off the communication and never to let forgiveness out of your heart because without it 
things become bitter and so much is lost in life.